Hey, good to have you along with us. Temperature's not bad. We're looking at highs today in the low 70s, but it is mighty humid. Overcast gray skies. Live look from the Emerald Law and Sky Live weather camera. Harker Heights, Texas. Out to the west of us, we've got a dry line. It has been active again. It's always active in the springtime on a daily basis, but it is sparking off a couple of showers out around Brady and Coleman of that area, generally moving towards the east, but more towards the southeast. So I think perhaps down towards uh, Blanco, Austin, that area could see a shower or two before the evening is over with. What we're concerned with is this action going on down here in the Gulf of Mexico. No, not a tropical storm or anything like that, but part of the dry line has developed into a low down over northern Mexico and drifted out over the Gulf waters, and that's helping keep all that moisture back up across the coastal plain and in our general direction. I think we'll start seeing some of that in the late night, early morning hours today in the record book 63 for a low 76 in the afternoon high temperatures running about five degrees cooler than they normally would. No additional rain officially today. A couple of sprinkles here and there. Our year to date total now stands at better than nine inches, but that's also better than five and a half inches behind where we would normally be for the month of May. Once again, even though with no rain, we still had too much moisture on the slide to take a pollen count today. Speaking of the rainfall, now this is over the last three days. Take a look at this. Better than half an inch officially in the Waco area. Now, this is satellite and Doppler estimated rainfall totals. Your mileage may vary, as they say. We've seen almost an inch of rain down towards Temple, Belton of that area, half an inch of rain estimated by the satellite and Doppler for the Coppers Cove and Colleen area. Right now, sun's trying to break through 74 degrees right now, 68% relative humidity. Winds are going to be easterly throughout much of the evening tonight. That still brings in that moisture and sets up the possibility of some rain for us later in the evening. Dry conditions, sunshine out across West Texas tomorrow. Cloudy and damp for us here along the I-35 corridor. South Texas getting a break from the rain they were seeing this morning as that low begins to push its way on back up the coast and basically in our general direction. For tonight, cloudy skies, 50% chances of rain. We'll keep rain chances in the forecast through tomorrow and for a couple of more days as that low kind of lingers. We'll make it to 79, so another humid afternoon for us, but I'm going to go 40% chances of drizzle as we start the day and about a 20% chance of rain showers in the afternoon tomorrow. Better shot at rain could be in the picture for us on Friday, possibly into Saturday. Leslie, Chris. All right, thanks, Andy.